good afternoon uh, students uh, welcome to the online lecture series number 1 the subject name is artificial neural network and fuzzy logic so um, basically uh, we have discussed the unit 1 already in the class and i have given you the questions of uh, first unit the second third fourth and fifth unit Uh, we have discussed few some parts of second unit, but uh, I'll discuss it again to avoid any confusion. And then we have third unit, fourth, and fifth unit. So as you can see, second unit is about neural network, uh, artificial neural network. And here we will discuss what are the similarities of artificial neural network with biological neural network system. and then in unit 3 we will discuss fuzzy logic unit 4 we will discuss uh, genetic algorithm uh, unit 5 we will discuss evolutionary algorithms uh, there are few evolutionary algorithms which we will discuss in unit 5 uh, i'm really sorry that uh, i have made the video based on the handwritten notes uh, i wanted to make the video on slides but then we have to solve some questions also on the paper so that's why i preferred the handwritten notes i have sent you these handwritten notes so please um, watch the video with these notes so as i was telling first we will go through little bit about uh, these three topics uh, neural network fuzzy logic and genetic algorithm which we will discuss in unit 2 3 and 4 of the course so artificial neural network so basically uh, if we talk about soft computing soft computing has to deal with these three things artificial neural network fuzzy logic and genetic algorithms okay so uh, we can say there are two types of computing one is hard computing and one is soft computing okay so as you can see in hard computing we have very precise models we have symbolic reasoning we have um, traditional numerical modeling and search and in soft computing we have approximate reasoning or we have functional approx and randomized search okay so soft computing is basically when you approximate things and when you have precise models you use hard computing okay so uh, soft computing came into the picture very uh, late like in uh, 1970s or so and uh, earlier we were using hard computing so in soft computing these three methods are very important artificial neural network fuzzy logic and genetic algorithms or you can also combine any two uh, of these three computing methods so that will be called hybrid okay so first we'll see artificial neural network so an artificial neural network is uh, nothing but a neural network uh, that depends on the uh, how your brain work so basically it takes um, takes idea from how your brain work and then we replicate this model we replicate this model in our computing okay you can see so if we talk about the application part of the artificial neural network you can see there are a lot of application of artificial neural network you can use it in neurobiology cognitive psychology linguistic philosophy economics engineering physics mathematics or computer science as artificial intelligence okay so i'll discuss ann later on in detail uh, now first we know what is fuzzy logic okay so fuzzy logic is uh, nothing uh, but it is a concept dealing with uh, the data which is not accurate okay so if you have inaccurate data sets so you, then you can use fuzzy logic system 
okay so how can we understand uh, the thing is i'll give you an example like uh, fuzzy logic and boolean logic have things in common um, and fuzzy logic and boolean logic are also different and but you can say they are kind of a similar things what happens in boolean logic you know you have only two answers either one or either zero in boolean okay so either your answer is a true or your answer is a false but in fuzzy logic it depends on degree of truth rather than zero or one okay